what's up guys welcome back to my youtube channel strings and gale for today's video i'm gonna be teaching you how to tune your violin using your ears yes you hear that right i know it's quite difficult to learn this technique but if i have done it myself i'm pretty sure you can do it yourself as well you just have to do it just do it just do it you just have to believe in yourself your dreams be dreams. Anyways, after tuning your violin, I'm also going to teach you how to play You Are My Sunshine, which is a very easy song and the best way to learn the violin, especially for beginners. But before that, I know you're excited, I am excited as well, but let's have to tune your violin because that's the always first thing that we need to do before playing a certain song. So without further ado, let's do it. In tuning the violin, you have to determine first what parts of the violin are being used in tuning. The main tuner of the violin is what we call pegs. These are pegs. So what we do is that we turn the pegs forward and backward. When you turn the peg forward, it means that you are tightening the tune of the certain string. And when you turn it backward, it means that you are loosening the tune of a certain string. Also, we have the so-called fine tuners. So these are the fine tuners of the violin. So what do we do with them? Actually, when we cannot adjust the tune of our violin using the pegs anymore, because sometimes there are instances that it's so hard to turn. So when you cannot adjust it there, you can use fine tuners to adjust the tune of your violin. What do we do is to turn them because it can be rotated. It can be turned clockwise and counterclockwise. When you use clockwise, it means that you are tightening the tune of a certain string. And then when you use counterclockwise, it means that you are loosening the tune of a certain string. Another thing that you need to know is you need to determine the pitch of each of every string. So we have the fourth string, it's the G or Sol. We have the third string, which we call the D or Re. We have the second string, which we call A or La. And we have the first string, which we call E or Mi. Now get your violin and let us tune together. I need to know if my violin is untuned. <laughs> Oh my god, what is this? <laughs> Actually, I want to try playing a certain song using my untuned violin. Let's see if it sounds good or not. Let's see, you are my sunshine. <laughs> Sorry for that guys, that was so awful. I really need to tune my violin. You don't really play untuned violin, do you? Because I don't. No, no, it's a big no, no. We need to tune our violin first before playing a song or people wouldn't, you know, listen to your music. What I have done before to actually learn tuning my violin through my ears was to have an online piano as a guide. You can just, you know, go to Google and search online piano or virtual piano or you can just go to Play Store and download pianos or you can just buy your own piano, it depends on you guys. Now let's start tuning the fourth string of the violin which is the G or Sol. I have a piano here and this is how G sounds like. you know the humming part as a practice so that's the G sound and this is my G string oh my god it's so long so I have to put it up it sounds the same now I think now let's tune the third string which is the D or Re this is how it sounds like This is how my violin sounds like. So I need it to put higher. It's the same now. Let's tune the second string, which is 
the A or La. So A sound or La sound sounds like this. That's my sound of my violin. <laughs> so different, isn't it? So I need to put it higher. A bit higher. You can adjust it on your fine tuner. That's nice. And now let's tune the first string, which is the E or Mi. So it sounds like this. So high. And this is the sound of my violin. Oh my god. It's a bit lower, so I need to put it higher. You need to be careful with the first string because it's the most common, you know, strings that always get broken whenever you tighten the peg. Oh, I get it. Yay! <laughs> if you aren't confident enough about tuning your violin, then you can always use a tool like this. It's a violin tuner and you can just buy it online. Now, let's check if I properly tuned my violin. If this screen turns to green, it means that I got it correctly or properly. So let's start with the fourth string. Nice. Third string. That's good as well. Second string. That's nice. And the first string. That's nice. Now that our violins are properly tuned, I am going to teach you the song, You Are My Sunshine on the Violin. I hope you enjoyed learning violin with me. 
I am going to upload another version of You Are My Sunshine on the Violin and it's going to be a tutorial as well. So if you want to see it, just come back and watch. If you have questions to ask, I'm very open. You can just follow or message me on my social media just right here. Don't forget to subscribe and, you know, click the bell below for more violin tutorial updates. See you guys in my next videos. Mwah.